At 127 million words, the proceedings of the Old Bailey cannot be read as a single text. This tutorial will help you locate materials relevant to your research and to use the main search facilities provided. The vast majority of searches can be pursued from the Search Home page, which allows you to combine keyword searches with searches of tag data associated with each trial and issue of the proceedings and ordinary of Newgate's accounts. The most powerful search facility is the keyword search box. It allows you to search an index of every word in the proceedings, with the exception of some short and common words, such as the and but. Below the keyword search box, there are four radio buttons. These allow you to both incorporate Boolean operators and or to define a phrase or to opt for an advanced setting that allows you to use the full search syntax available through MySQL, the search engine used by the site. A typical search might start with a single word. You might, for instance, wish to find beggars on the streets of London and could simply put the word beggar in the keyword search box. This produces 105 results. You might, however, only be interested in beggars found on the street and could add the word street to your search. The default setting for the radio buttons is AND, so this search would produce text in which both the words beggar and street appear. There are 85 trials and ordinaries accounts that meet these conditions. But this search excludes relevant instances where the precise word was beggars or begging rather than beggar. You can expand your search to include both alternate spellings and descriptive words by choosing the OR button below the search box. Adding these words and selecting OR produces 703 results. You can also choose the Phrase radio button, which allows you to search for precise phrases. One description that is commonly associated with beggars is about the streets, as in begging about the streets. Entering this phrase in the keyword search box and selecting the Phrase radio button produces 527 results. Finally, you can select the Advanced Radio button, which allows you to use wildcards, Boolean operators, and more complex syntax. Please read the associated What's This text for details on how to apply these functions. Regardless of the radio button selected, the keyword search box works with a full index of every word in the proceedings. The remaining search boxes on the search home page work differently and address indexes of tagged information in individual trials and texts. This tagged information has been developed by modern historians and reflects their interpretation of the text. The next three search boxes are surname, forename, and alias, and these and any other search boxes on this page can be combined to generate more complex searches. These three search boxes address an index of text that has been identified as either a surname, forename, or alias. In other words, although tagged to indicate that the text is a name, it is indexed in its original and unedited form. As a result, you may need to search for alternative spellings in order to locate specific names. These search boxes are set to search for all the words entered. You can also use a wildcard operator, a star, to search for names that begin with the same letters but end differently. The next three boxes address a different type of index and locate elements of the text that have been labeled with standardized descriptions by modern historians. The pull-down menus for offense, verdict, and punishment list the standardized categories that have been applied to each of the 197,000 trials in the proceedings. By selecting Killing Murder from the pull-down menu you can locate all 2,650 instances of murder in the proceedings. It's important to remember, however, that these categories reflect a modern interpretation of the trials. Some instances of murder, for instance, might have just as plausibly been included under manslaughter or infanticide. The Search In box is particularly useful when undertaking a keyword or name search and allows you to specify whether you wish to search only the trials themselves or the other elements of the printed proceedings, including the front matter, which lists the names of judges and juries, the punishment summary, advertisements, and ordinaries accounts. The time period boxes allow you to limit your search by date, and the reference number box allows you to navigate back to a specific trial or piece of text by entering a unique reference code. You can also use the Personal Details, Statistics, 
map and place, and browse by pages to locate and represent text and information from the proceedings. The associated records search page allows you to query an extensive database of documents relating to Old Bailey trials. You can also use the custom search page to create queries that combine all the different search boxes available from each of the search pages available.